What's going on guys, R9 here, and as you can see, we have another nature box. Alright, so I'm alone on this opening today, uh, many reasons, but we'll not get into that. Let's go into the nature box. Alright, so this is my second nature box. Uh, if you haven't seen the first one, please go do so. Um, this one, I did not pick anything that's coming in it, so I have no idea. Uh, I did completely random, so I'm seeing it for the first time right now. Okay. Set that to the side. Whoa. I have no idea. Oh, that, that looks good. Okay. Just get everything out. And then we will throw the box to the side. Okay. So... What I got in this box was one package of Granny Smith apples. Um, that is these. I think they're dried apples. So that's pretty cool. I got uh, black and white granola. No idea. Cocoa and vanilla flavored granola. That's kind of cool. I, I changed it so it would uh, send me sweeter things instead of like poppy seed sticks and stuff. But I didn't pick what was in it. Uh, sourdough cheddar pretzels. Whoa. Pretzel bites with cheddar cheese and a hint of beer. We will have to see how that tastes. Okay. And then cinnamon swirl kettle kernels. Kettle kernels? Oh, okay. Yeah. It's like... Um, um, I don't know what they call them. Yet. We used to get them all the time. And then last, it was salt and pepper lentil loops. It looks like, um, popcorn, kind of? I have no idea. But it's sealed, so I don't know. Okay, alright, let's start with the cinnamon swirl kettle corn. Go ahead and bust this. It's got stuff all over it. I don't know. Let me wipe that off. Didn't get a free one this time, so that's that kind of sucks. But, alright. Pop this open here. Oh, that smells amazing. It smells like cinnamon toast crunch. Mmm. Alright, get, get a good handful here. Alright. Mm. Really crunchy. That's awesome. I would highly recommend that. That was delicious. That's going to be gone today. Okay. Sourdough cheddar pretzels. Not quite sure what to think about these. I don't like pretzels, like just normal like salt pretzels. But maybe these cheddar ones will be good. Well, let's go ahead and grab one. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> I got the hint of beer. That's interesting. That's really good. It's kind of like. Um, combos, if you've ever had combos, but you do get the hint of beer in there. That's pretty good. All right, I'm gonna have to have my dad try try those. Let's save those glass. Okay, black and white granola. That came off really easy. But see, I I don't really know how to eat granola. Do I put it in milk? Do I put it in yogurt? I don't know. I've never... Like, I've had granola bars that I just eat the bar. But let's get a couple chunks of the black and the white there. Oh my god. That is amazing. I don't know how you're supposed to eat it, but I'm just going to eat it by the handful. Wow. This box is a lot better than the last one. Okay, oh. 
salt and pepper lentil loops. I still don't know what lentil loops are. It's in like a like a chip bag. I don't want to open the whole top of it though. Salt and pepper lentil loops. Oh, okay. It's like a rolled up potato chip. I don't know if you guys can see that or not. Yeah, it's just a potato chip. But it's, it looks funny. It's like a corkscrew. That's good. I like sweeter things, but that's fine. It's just like a potato chip, but salt and pepper. Uh, strange fact about me, I don't put salt and pepper on any food. So, I don't know, that's a little, a little much for me. Alright, and the last, Granny Smith apples. I have never tried dried apples. So, I'm just going to dive on it. Okay, get a good smell first. Oh, that's very apple-y. I love apples. Love apples. They come in, well, this is just a chunk, but it comes in a full, like, circle slice. I just got a chunk here. That's an apple. Hmm. Probably should have ate it before the salt and pepper, though. Tastes like a Granny Smith apple. It's really good. Kind of chewy, kind of crunchy. I like that. Alright. Hmm. Alright, so my review on this whole box. Everything's great. This, this one was way better than the last one. I would suggest... Um, going through and picking your preferences before you order a box. Um, last time I didn't and it was completely random and I got some things that I don't usually like. But this time it was really good. Uh, kind of disappointed in the salt and pepper lentil loops. I don't. Need, I still don't know what that word means. But they're not bad. Um, yeah, I'd, I'll sit there and eat them. But if you guys are interested in getting a nature box I actually have a, um, a a promo code, a friend code or whatever. If you use my code, you get $10 off of your first one, so it's only $10. And I also get a $10 credit, which isn't that much, but um, it, it helps a little bit. So if you guys want to try it out, you can try it for $10, and it's free shipping. But I'll have the, the code in the description, so yeah, just copy and paste that when you place your order. And yeah, um... My favorite thing, I'll pick a favorite. Hmm. I'm gonna have to go with the black and white granola. That really, really hit the spot. I don't know how to eat granola though, so I'm just gonna eat it by the handful. But yeah, black and white granola, that is my pick for this uh, month. So yeah, hope you guys like this. Uh, Till next time, later.